It's been really tough having two children diagnosed with cancer. We've lived with uncertainty really since Henry was diagnosed. We're going back to 2012. He was five months when he fell ill. It was very, very sudden. It was a massive shock. We discovered that he had a, a brain tumour. He was very, very seriously ill. It was all a massive, massive shock. We, we had no idea. It just came from nowhere. It, it was really, really shocking. While Henry was finishing his treatment, the family was dealt a second blow. Henry's older brother, Edward, was also diagnosed with a rare cancer. Finding out about Edward was a massive shock because we'd only just sort of got over Henry, really, and, and, and that we were still a bit battered and bruised from, from Henry's diagnosis and treatment and recovery. It's absolutely awful to watch your children go through a diagnosis of cancer, to see the worry and the stress that it causes to them, all the horrible invasive treatment and how sick and ill they become. And you just give anything as a parent for it to be you. You don't want your children to go through it. You just feel enormous guilt that they're suffering and they're going through it and you're not. You just want to swap places with them, basically. Of course it was scary. I mean, um, you, you never fully know what's going on and then you, know, you have all this medicine around you and stuff and you don't really know what it's doing. And you know, you, you, the only thought inside of you is just, you know, please get me out of here. I just want everything to be better because when you're going through it, you just want a normal life again. So I was, I was very scared. Henry and Edward responded well to treatment and are both now in remission. Everything is a lot better, and I think we just appreciate life more. Things are really, really good now for the boys, so we're focusing on how well and healthy they are, and yeah, and how, how lucky, really, we've all been. We have a normal life now, and the worry is always there, but life is good.